coming back from all the stuff we talked about, I feel like I need to get your opinion on this. What is your honest opinion of OnlyFans? It's popping right now. It's like everybody and mama got an OnlyFans. What you think about OnlyFans? I don't think everybody and their mother is getting the same bag, though. Like some bitches, oh, I made a couple hundred dollars last month, and I'm like, in a month? Yeah. Or I made a couple hundred, or I made, like, mom girls that are on OnlyFans, they're like on TV shows. Mm. So, and they're professional porn stars. Not the bullshit porn stars, like this Houston local porn star shit. Yeah. <laughs> the people we talking about, I don't know if you know what I'm talking about, but <laughs> that ghetto ass porn shit made in the fucking Motel 6. No, like, these are professional porn stars that are on there, so they have a fan base, a platform, so where they're making half a meal for $50,000 in a month or like. So. You think OnlyFans is fucking up the porn game? It's, it's, <laughs> Not for them because that's what they do for a living. So, to my understanding is, they don't have to care. They're going to get their money regardless. Mm. That's what they do for a living. They're porn stars. They don't porn. Like, you're on TV. You have this big fan base. Yeah. What about the strip um, again? Does this OnlyFans kind of cut into Honestly, the I'm tired of seeing, like, people's black ass ass cracks in my fucking timeline feed. Like, especially every light skin bitch that has, like, a shade of fucking, like... Any bitch, like, bleach your asses. Like, I'm bleach your asses? Bleach your asses, whoa, whoa. bleach your ass cracks. Like, that's what the porn stars do, and they look clean and nice. That's oh, why when wow. y'all watch... Yeah, that's why it looks so clean. You don't see that fucking dark ass... Like, a dark ass shadow. Like, I'm tired of seeing this long, these long ass ass cracks. Damn, I'm not, I'm just not finding out that's a, that's a thing. I really am. Like, it's not even tasteful at this point. Like, That's what Kanye girls, was talking about. They're not leaving... They're not leaving anything to the imagination. No, like, damn. Like, like, it's all out there now. Yeah, like, just subscribe, click the link in my bio, and it's just like, I'm not trying to shade nobody. But again, like, I'm a part of the game. If you're a part of the game, why are you watering it down? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's like a... It's it, like a... It's like this. It's like, like an in-between. Like, I'm here, I'm here, but it's like... I feel like... I'm not here, and I'm not here for it. Like, I don't know. Like, it's like... The, to me, look, to me, the OnlyFans is like how like niggas used to sell CDs and get paid out the trunk. Now it's like now they streaming. Like this girl literally just had this. Are you about to pull it up? The stupidest argument for me about this shit. Like the dance locker room posted this this funny video with this guy stating how girls are only fans accounts be. And he's posing and doing the shit the bitches do. Like, I ain't never seen no in Click no. my name in my bio. Type I ain't never shit. Seen the only he's time. making fun of, you know. That shit do be funny, though. What the dancers is doing and what everybody's doing. How they're doing it. Some chicks so, is making money, though, they say. He says only $15, like $15.99, subscribe, right? He makes that comment. So I get in the comments and I say, it's actually $2.99. These motherfuckers don't even sell for $15. Mm. My friend laughs that I know in real life. This other chick that I don't even know, we don't follow each other. I don't even care for your existence. I didn't look for you, bitch. Mm. She responds to my comment and says, we in a major economic crisis, so we got to sell prices. We got sell prices going on. <laughs> bitch, I don't give a fuck what crisis we're going through. I ain't selling myself short. And I feel like a lot of you bitches get on this fucking OnlyFans and you sell yourself short. You don't even leave shit for the imagination. Like, damn, if you're going to be special, it's four ninety nine, two ninety nine. why aren't you posting, like, tasteful content to where you leave shit for the imagination? You just bare-ass naked or, like, every video is the same. It's, like... That's like them niggas selling that cheap-ass dope. Fuck out of here. And then <laughs> she makes that comment. We in a major economic crisis, so we got to sell, sell prices going on. You sound like an idiot, bitch. I said, I don't care. I ain't selling my pussy for two ninety nine. That's watering down the game. Do what y'all want to do. If my joke offends y'all, it shouldn't. Yeah. It don't matter what's going on in the world. If you that bitch, motherfuckers is going to buy your content regardless. Don't sell yourself short. Demand what you're worth and make them respect you. Mm. What's wrong with what I said? And here's another thing. A lot of these hoes was opposed to OnlyFans. I pay attention. Mm. You talked all that shit about OnlyFans. And as soon as outside was closed... 
And sometimes you're still going to work because let's be racist. They open in the club a little bit, letting these hoes go to work secretly. <laughs> you know, having certain people come spend money. It's like a lot of you hoes care so much and you ran instantly to OnlyFans. So mm. I don't know whether to respect y'all for it or not. Because mm. you care so fucking much like you got your life together and we all in the same game. You know what I'm saying? Some of us have the same shit. You have less or some of y'all don't even have a fucking place to stay and lockdown is here and you're all over the place. And yeah. it's just like, I'm just really like, I'm not opposed to us at all. I just... Just hate water. the way some of these bitches are and operate and watering down the game and like watering down the game and then putting down other bitches that's trying to get some money and it's just like bitches look really desperate at this time hmm. and I know a lot of people are going to watch this probably and be offended by what I'm saying but bitches you, you got you got the generation your generation you have us looking like as our gender looking like some fucking clowns hmm. and I get to get your coins but it's like Everybody ain't getting by with that. It's all crap. And it's just like, you got to have thick skin to do some shit like that. Yeah. Like, real. you first of all have to have thick skin to dance. But I feel like you got to have even thicker, really thick skin to get online and do OnlyFans. Straight and up. some people's, their content is, is dope. It's tasteful. I think Mercedes Moore, Kayla G. I ain't never seen no H. Uh, I think. No OnlyFans. I think, I'm curious, though. I think their content it's just so nice and sexy and then I got all this black shadow ass crack just in my <laughs> in my fucking timeline it's annoying <laughs> I'm muting stories and posts cause I'm like this is so crazy bitch get your shadow game up ladies <laughs> this is crazy <laughs> like wow this shit is and then I get a lot of can you promo me or can, you, can I pay you to post me or can you can you please share my events? I don't want to. The shit looks disgusting. <laughs> you I have okay, here's one. Have you seen Oh, she said, baby, all the porn stars have low prices with hundreds of videos on their page and I make a decent amount. So you make a decent amount. Yeah, man. So let me tell you something about like all the porn DoorDash. stars that have their shit for two ninety nine. It's like doing DoorDash. Get a little I'm sure they're giving over <laughs> over a hundred subscribers every day, bitch. Yeah. So their math is their bread is longer than yours, but you're comparing yourself to porn stars having OnlyFans. And, they and have, you're a fucking nobody. And they have so real tangible fan base. They have hundreds of videos yeah. on their page, and I make a decent amount. You get them in, in the door, then sell videos, customs, calls, and extras. Bitch, why are you explaining yourself to me? Girl, why are you ta why are you taking my jokes so personal? Who f she must she must be a two ninety nine bitch. <laughs> Who fucking cares? Like I don't give a fuck if you sell your asshole on here for ninety nine cents. Two ninety nine, forty dollars. I don't give a fuck. Like I don't know you. And who was this? Stop explaining yourself. Some bitch on the dancer locker room page. Like, oh, okay. Bitch. Shout out to dancers locker room, man. We yeah, check shout out. out to you. Like, damn, it's a bunch of dumbass bitches in the comments, bro. Like, <laughs> but look, have page you, is dope, though. Have you heard about Miss Megan's uh, OnlyFans page? Miss Megan Sauce Walker's personal assistant, music business, TFS, TSF business assistant. Have you heard about? That's a that's a. a a popping issue right now at the moment. <laughs> you, you, you ain't hear about that? Um, you know what? If Miss Megan is getting a fucking check, let her. Hmm. For sure, for sure. Let her. That was so. Yeah, that's that's stirring up, that's stirring you know up a lot of smoke in the city, though. I will say this: it's stirring up a lot of smoke, but it's like, like I just said, a lot of you bitches don't even try. You're not appealing. I'm tired of seeing certain bitches in my timeline what they, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> so it's like yeah. if she's getting money and she's eating from it, let her, because a lot of people will. A lot of people hating her. A lot of people will hate you and bash you, and I and I and I and I feel like I've been there. Like people will bash me for no reason, or feel like they know me personally off Instagram, or just from seeing me in the strip club because we didn't dance together and won't know me personally. They'll bash me off of something that I post, or they'll just bash me. And I feel like I feel like 
Don't be don't don't go don't go in on, on Miss Megan so much for trying some shit out that they say it worked though. They that everybody's she, promoting and if she's getting a bag off it, let her eat off of it because like I just said, a lot of bitches is capping. They're not really getting to the bag. Hmm. You know, like yeah, they say if she got a lot of clout from it, she's doing something. Hmm. And um You know, if she's eating, let her eat because a lot of these people have an opinion on her, but are you financing her? Hmm. Are you fucking her? Yeah. How is it really harming you? Right. What is it doing to you that's so bad that's affecting your life? Right. She's getting a check like the rest of you bitches. She's getting a check. Okay. Yeah. So maybe, maybe Mr. Sauce Walk will turn it on to to some money and you think you know, that's what it was you think he dripped some sauce on him I, I don't I don't mm, I don't what I mean is it may be something that's playing a positive role in her life right now everybody doesn't have to agree with everyone's decisions and right you don't know people's reasons and it might she might not have reasons she might just want to get some money like mm -hmm. you know it's crazy like you're shaming her, but mm -hmm. bitches is fucking for free with no place to stay. <laughs> no place to stay. Nigga won't even buy you a cheeseburger. <laughs> but you're mad at this lady because what she's older and the biggest MILF TFS TSS business. She's older <laughs> and she's getting a check that a 21 year old bitch could be getting that's not even getting, not using her goods to get that. Hey, what's up though? If it's working for Miss Megan. Yeah. Let her have that. Yeah, they say she's she milking that milk too. I feel like they're they're going to they're going in on her too hard. Like, but it started, of course, it started with it, it's too much. The most of the friction, of course, started with with uh, B King's post. You know, what I'm saying when she kind of you know. I, I didn't understand that. Yeah. I guess go ahead. Like, well, okay, so what B King did was he used the picture from OnlyFans, I guess, with the camel toe as a part of an advertisement. For his new song, it was like the name of the song was Then Leave. Yeah, I've heard Then Leave. Uh, the radio station been playing it. Right. It's so, just a cool song. But what he did was he used the words Then Leave, but instead of a V, he had the actual picture with her camel toe to be the V and then leave. And then also he tagged, like, I think her daughter had, had made a big post and tagged her. And how her daughter felt embarrassment behind it. Just a lot of other stuff like post the, you know what I'm saying? Just, you know, screenshotting some stuff. They say, but that's what turned Sauce Walker up, which brought that friction to like, hey, ain't no hating on this business over here. And like, you know. And he may feel so strongly about it. Like, I don't know him on a personal level. Right. I remember when. I was in this club and the sauce twins came in the club and all the hoes was flocking to them and hey, like like I said, um just from the outside looking in, like from somebody that makes a lot of money, like you know. If he turned her on to that, I mean, I mean, he sees nothing wrong with it. It's, you know, it's a natural way of getting money to him. Should it might be that. I don't know him personally to to tell you to tell you that, but um, I would say that. I mean, they're both artists. I don't know if that's really, you know. Do you think B King was out of line though? Something to argue about because I still don't even understand it really after you. It is, but it is, it. it is kind of confusing and tricky though. I think it'll boil over though. It's just one of the moments. Mm hmm. Maybe it, it may be that. You know what? Back up. You said that she, he's his, she's his manager. Yeah, well, assistant. Or assistant. Or, she has a, a business called I know Isis. that Miss Megan has been playing, you know, her, her, her role in, you know, assisting and always I always see that she posts their everything that that they do so um she has that tattoo you know so yeah, it's like that's, um yes she does mm -hmm. that's it's like me defending my someone that's important to me yeah you know like I get it from a certain <laughs> angle and 
I get it from Justin's angle too, you know, like me and Justin, we're cool. Like I said, a lot of a lot of my following came from doing plenty of videos as music, so I, I will never bash Justin. You know, it's not an argument that I really want to intervene in or get get in the middle of, you know? Right, Because right, it, right. it don't have anything to do with me. For sure. But you asked me about what do I think about Miss Megan shit, if she's even better get it, and um, not that I don't have any remorse for her daughter or anything like that, but it's like, um, we're not always going to understand our parents Thanks. and they're not always going to understand us. And, um, I feel that, you know, there's a trial and error for everything, for everybody. And if there's not, then there's not, but you know, like, I don't personally know what's going on in between her and her daughter. So that's kind of like a sticky situation. And to see other people like posting the daughter's screenshot in my timeline it's like why are we putting our energy into that like why are we bringing this negative shit to light it's the internet I'm not saying fuck her daughter's feelings but it's like why are we pointing it out and just trying to base this lady base her to be this bad mom because she made only fans hmm. you know yeah like I said, I don't know what Miss Megan is doing for. It's her choice. It's her prerogative. It's her body. It's it's her life. You know. That's true, man. I just want to get your take on that. You know what I'm saying? They say she ran it up, though. I mean, shit. Then she ran it up. If that's what they said she did, if that's what she's doing, let her. Straight up. Let her. <laughs> because I can't remember the last time or a first time where I paid a bill to Miss Megan or or anybody. So it don't matter. Or anybody I know, you know, so paid a bill for her. I, I don't, so I don't know. Yeah, it don't cool. matter. What's your take on it? Yeah, that's my take on it. Hell yeah. So let, before we get out of here, I want to talk about NFL. Because we about, we about to let them go. Continue.